What's up YouTube, welcome back to a new video. Today I have a new product review. This is the Dunk Crate. Dunkcrate.com is their website. I'll have that in the description below. So they reached out to me and um, are having me try out their product. The packaging, I must say, is very nice. I like how they have their own box. Dunkcrate.com. Very big compared to other stuff we do. So I'm just, just fitting it on. Um, we have this gold sticker here because this is the gold edition, at least I'm assuming that. There is the gold $100 version, which I'm assuming this is, and the regular $50 version. Shipping, to my knowledge, is free. I, I added it to cart and didn't show shipping costs, so I'm assuming shipping is free. That's nice. Now let's get into it and show you what we got. In the background, we have some Ben Simmons and some Kawhi Leonard action, some fun guy right there. And my Instagram, go check it out if you haven't already. So the box is really nice. On the background, they actually have all these different products in here. Now, I don't know if you can actually find these ones in here, like a pack of Contenders Draft, or like, um, I don't know. Let's take our stuff out first, though, so we can kind of get this box off the screen. Um, we have some mystery items. So this is the, once again, the gold $100 version, and this will come with 10 mid to high-end packs. It'll come with one high-end auto, one high-end mem card, which I'm assuming are these two. And then it also comes with several unique mystery basketball items, as well as um, some other surprises. So, let me get this out here. I'm quickly just get all this out on the desk. I uh, made a little bit of a mess, but we'll clean it up. So here the, is the inside. I don't. I doubt you can find a pack of limited in there because limited. I'm pretty sure they only have one pack, maybe. But there's a lot of nice stuff in there. Um, the packs. It does say random pack, so I'm assuming you can get really any basketball packs they must have a assortment and let's uh, get into what we have here so I'm gonna show you a few small items first that just to clear out the way we have a Miami Heat pencil a Knicks pencil and a Bullets pencil now the Wizards I actually collected pencils when I was young I didn't like go out on my way to collect them but I would never sharpen them and I would keep them all so I have like a bag a brown bag and I know where it is now it's still um just full of pencils so I actually can add to my little pencil collection there we go then we have a Pacers sticker. I wonder if they have any Grizzlies ones. At least I'm assuming that's a sticker. I'm not going to find out, but if it is, then we have a 97 98 basketball upper deck sticker. So, six sticker pack. I'm going to open this right now. Oh, it's already open, actually. I wonder how old this stuff is. Let's see who we have. Uh, Dumars, uh, I think like Bryant Reeves, something like that, and then Murris, something, I forgot the names, let's see. Oh, and they'll show you. This Kobe, a bunch of guys, any Jordans? Oh, this Ku Coach. Uh, we're gonna, the end. All right. So, some nice ones. I like the Ku Coach. Ku Coach is pretty cool. But yeah, some stickers from, I guess, 97, 98. Jordan staring into your soul there. Now let's see some other mystery items. We'll finish off with the packs. We have a nice little stuffed bear. It says Scotty, I guess that's his name. For the uh, Rockets, Houston Rockets, I guess. Um, gold, Golden Bear, it's collectible bear. Basketball Series 1. These Beanie Babies, I guess? Oh, and uh, oh, so Scotty Pippen <laughs> for Houston. All right, there we go. So Gold Bear is 23 carats, says, made in China. Like most things. All right, cool. When did they have a nice Grizzlies bear? But cool, nice little cute bear mascot for this video. Uh, I don't know where I'm gonna put them. Let's put them right here for now. Gets the rest. All right. Then we have. Oh, we have a Maverick sticker. Didn't even see that one. So that Luca. And then. Okay, so then we have uh, some figures here. So it looks like Muggsy Bogues. Not bobbleheads because the head is uh, connected. So, and then we have Sea Web with the Wizards, not with the Kings, but still cool. All right, so there are your, I guess your, you know, surprises and your random basketball items. And now we have our pack slash singles. So let's start with this pack right here, and then we'll get into these ones because this is just a retail 15, 16 pack, uh, hanger pack. Carefully, so here's what we have 
Once again, for hundred dollars, let's see if it's uh, worth it. What we get in, in the stuff. Now you could get nothing, nothing in the packs, but you could still get solid pack value. Um, it's all up to the, I guess the beauties in the eye of the beholder. So Marcus Smart is our first card. Then we have Russell Westbrook, uh, Darren Williams, Rajon Rondo. We have an Al Horford, Greg Monroe. We have a Derek Williams. Derek Favors, Yusuf Nurkic, Tim Duncan Elite Series, uh, Passing Kings, Muggsy Bogues, Kelly Uber Jr. Rookie, Frank Kaminsky Rookie, Dylan Wright, now a Grizzly, and um, Terry, Scary Terry, the rookies. Oh, these guys were rookies that year? I didn't know that. Um, nothing I see on the back here. If I miss any numbering or something like that. I don't think I did. All right, so there you go. Nice little rack pack there. Actually, where are the rookies at? We'll we'll sort them because we will end up ripping the other packs too. So, inserts rookies. We'll put that here. So there we are, a little rack pack. Not too sure why this card's like separated. See? I don't know. Oh well. If I miss something, just let me know. So uh, we'll end with these two, and I guess. Actually, no, we'll, we'll do these two now because we need some room here. So, um, this one is significantly thicker, so I'm going to start with this one. Let's open this up. Now, th this, these guys are, um, they originally make the dugout crate, I believe. So, if you guys are baseball fans, you might be familiar with them. Then they also made a basketball and a football one. So, if you're interested in those sports, there you go. And Ooh, Danny Green. Wow. It's not bad. National Treasures NBA Game Gear from 1415. I always, for some reason, thought Danny Green was really old, and then I checked his age, and he's like 31. So, uh, it's, it wasn't sleeved or anything, but it, to my knowledge, isn't really dinged either. 16 of 75, autos on card. Um, game worn, too. That's actually pretty sweet. Danny Green's a baller. All right, let me uh, get a sleeve for him so he's nice and safe. I always like reviewing stuff like this. It's very fun. And I love doing basketball stuff, so definitely having a good time right now. I'm very interested to see what packs we have, though. The first one off the top is definitely an intriguing one. Let me carefully cut this and slide our Danny boy in here. Always good to get something from National Treasures. Yeah, my one, so far, one of my one recommendations would be definitely sleeve these. I mean, there's a small little... I know, I'm sorry, sorry I'm shining this light in your faces, like I'm trying to see. I think there's a small nick right there. Oh yeah, you can see it right there. Um, but nothing crazy, still a nice card. So we're gonna scoot these guys over, put our first hit down. And now we have what should be our, um, our high-end game used. So let's pop this guy open. it pulling it out so Carmel Anthony oh versus Kevin Durant let's see that's pretty cool 179 of 199 from preferred pull it up nice and carefully all right so booklets are always very nice um and once again, this wasn't sleeves, but it is very hard to protect booklets. I mean, there's a little bit of a, a little bit of white showing through it there. But let's see what we got. Mellow and KD. Pretty cool. I always like booklet cards. They look nice. Was this the year, or was it the next year, where they went up, like just nuts going, um, going for the scoring title? I think Mellow ended up winning it, but yeah, game worn. So that's pretty cool. All right. I always, I always wish they would tell us what game they were, it was born for. Like, not just game worn, but I just, oh, this game where you put up like X amount of points, you know? All right, so now let's get into these packs. What I've been definitely looking forward to. So here's all our packs. I think it said expect 10, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So there you go. 10. Um, right off the bat, I know that these are not all hobby. So this is 16, 17 select. I don't believe this was in retail format. It's a thick pack, but 
This is a hobby pack. So is Aficionado. I don't believe there's a retail version of that. Now this is status. Um, I believe, I think this is a retail pack. I'm, I'm making my guesses based on just what I know. I don't know everything though. So I think I think this is a, uh, one of the hobby ones. Now, if you could, if you know otherwise, definitely let me know. This is the Chinese New Year one for sure. Right there. It's red, that's why. Then this is a retail contender draft picks because the hobby are thick. This should be retail because it's five cards as opposed to six. This is also retail because 1819 Donruss was a thick pack for hobby jumbo. Then this should be the mega box exclusives, I think. Yeah, and this uh, prestige. This is uh, crystals, so it's a retail one. And this might this one might be hobby. Retail and hobby both have the same amount of cards in it, but the fact that you can get the one of ones, I think this might be a hobby pack. So let's go. Let's see. Like this. Excalibur, this one, and then we'll start with um, put this guy back here. Start with prestige. Go threads. Domus optic, and then like this. So let's see what we get. Starting with our pack of prestige, and nice player in the back. Not his rookie year, but Trey Lyles. We have a Josh Hustis autograph. I didn't see the autograph thing on the back. Huh. Usually Panini's like, oh, we guarantee this autograph, whatever. Oh, there we go. Right there, completely missed it. Nice. So we do have a hit. Let me sleeve them up. It is a sticker auto, but he kept it all on. I haven't heard of his name for a long time. Bonus shots autograph. So there we go. Technically three hits already. Then we have a Blake Griffin acetate card. Pretty cool. I always like acetate cards. Some people don't like them, especially signed ones because the ink kind of, um, I don't know, just kind of like fades a bit and gets chipped. But I do like to look at them, especially the clear tickets from Contenders Football. Those are great. Giannis, Serge Ibaka when he's with the Magic, and Kevin Love. There we go. So that's our prestige. Now for some threads. All right. So let's see who we get. We have Rondo, Yogi Ferrell, High Octane, Damon Stoudemire. Then we have Rudy Gay and CJ McCollum. Love Rudy. All right, Don Russ. So this is retail Don Russ. I don't know if these have any um, next day autos, but eh, I'm not going to read it. Oh, well, we'll, we'll find out. See if we get anything. I think the next day autos and the the veteran autos, those are the highlights of the stuff for me. There are RPAs, but those are okay to me. Tim Hardaway Jr., Gary Payton, Hall Kings. We have a rated rookie, Devontae Graham. We have Mello, Troy Brown Jr., and Captain Clutch Mike Conley. Alright, so getting a little bit of messy messy uh, stack here. Now for some checkerboard, hopefully, from 1718 Optic, is it? Uh, I'm pretty sure it is. All right, right in the front, we have a Jer Allen. I've never seen a rookie on the front. Saw one of the Nets. Nets are, Nets are looking real good once KD's healthy again. Uh, Jonathan Simmons, James Harden, Court Kings, and Arian Ilyasova. So here's a blaster pack. I think these have one auto per box and like maybe six or six packs, something like that, maybe five packs. I don't know. I never opened these blasters, at least not anymore. Marquise Chris, Scotty Pippen, uh, Justin Patton. He's He hasn't really done much. Game Bay ticket. School colors, John Collins. He actually has done some. Hawks looking good. Hernan Gomez and Shaq. All right, Revolution. So I think we get one Chinese New Year parallel, maybe, and at least one rookie. So we have Steph Curry, uh, Kenneth Farid, 
John Wall, and hey, that's pretty sweet. Kyle Kuzma and uh, DJ Wilson. So our, our Chinese New Year, oh, cracked ice was Kyle Kuzma, the one remaining Laker. Although if I were the Lakers, I'd bring him off the bench. Even though he's a good player, based on who they have, I think he'd be better off the bench. These are not numbered, but they're nice cards. Nice and shiny. This year, I think they added like super short print parallels, like numbered to 8 to 88. Really nice stuff. So now we get into what I suspect is the hobby stuff. So status first. You have Danilo Gallinari, Kemba Walker, now a Celtic, Tarian Prince, Tony Bradley, rookie credentials. You have a Factions, Chauncey, Rip Hamilton, and Ben Wallace. Then we have another DJ Wilson. It's a pretty cool insert right here for the Pistons. Three packs left. A pack of Excalibur. I always like this stuff, especially because of the Kabooms and the Crusades. But they stopped coming out with it. Pack got a little butchered there, but it'll make it. We have a shiny thing. I think it's a Crusade. Chris Dunn. If you ever get a Kaboom, seeing him it shining through, that, that's a lot of fun. So Chris Dunn, DeMar DeRozan. Wait, Chris Dunn goes here. There we go. DeMar DeRozan, Russell Westbrook, and Kyrie Irving Crusade. Nice. Back with the Cavs. Then we have Tim Hardaway Jr., James Harden, Kimba Walker, and Darren Williams. All right, aficionado. This product's nice. It's very cheap right now. You can get a box for like maybe 40, 50 bucks, something like that. But aficionado basketball. Really cool design. So you have D'Angelo Russell. Lakers traded, uh, not really Lakers, the um, Lakers did trade him, but now Golden State traded for him. Not the best fit, but they're going to try to probably trade him again. And uh, we have Pascal Siakam. Solid rookie, most improved player. We have a power surge of Aaron Gordon. Artist proof. Then a dragon bender. Slick picks. Not the slickest pick, but dragon. Nice. Cameron Payne. Artist proof. Cool, cool. Thon Maker, rookie. Jalen Brown, rookie. And Alfred Payton. I personally like these designs. I wouldn't mind seeing it back. But, of course, updated a bit. And then our last pack is 16-17 um, Select. This is a thick pack, but there are fillers in the stuff. Uh, but we do have a hit, I think. Alright. Yeah, that's a hit. All right, so we have Omri Caspi, Ramon Sessions, pull from the back, Marco Bellinelli, uh, Jake Lehman. Get that to focus a little better, there we go. And Tony Parker. Is this one numbered? This one's not numbered. So a base jersey of him. Quick fact, if you want to read that there while I sleeve him up. And that'll actually do it for the whole box. So a lot of stuff. You get a pretty heavy stack of cards, goodies, whatnot. So we'll quickly flip through this. Jalen Brown, rookie. Dragon Bender. Pascal Siakam. Kyrie. We have a Tony Bradley. Not Tony Bradley. Um, oh, yeah, Tony Bradley. Jared Allen. And a bunch of other stuff. Blake Acetate. And that's pretty much it. So decent little stack of inserts, rookies, whatnot here. Then we get into this stack. We got some nice stuff. Our Tony Parker with the Spurs Relic, which is what you want him with, not with the Hornets. Nice Kuzma. Red Ice, Red Chinese New Year parallel from um, Revolution. Then we have a bonus shots, Josh Hustis, something like that. Autograph, a KD and Mellow booklet. game-worn, and then a Danny Green auto jersey. Pretty solid. Plus all our bonuses. We got Scotty. We have some stickers. 
more stickers and three pencils. So, oh, oh, yeah, I forgot. Seaweb and uh, Mugsy. So pretty solid haul. Um, this, once again, this is a hundred dollars, I believe, for this gold version. And um, it's up to you guys if you're interested. You can get it at the website down below. It is here. Let me pull the box back up. Right here on the side of the box, if I can get this in without destroying everything I own. Dunkcrate.com. There you go. This will also be in the video description. So go check them out if you want. Once again, there are two different options for you if you're interested. And yes, nice stuff. I think my favorite card is probably going to be. I have two favorites. Well, these two. Nice Danny Green Auto and the Kuzma. So that's going to do it for the Dunk Crate. Once again, go check them out. Link in bio. And um, that'll do it. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and sub. And I'll see you guys later.